Hello folks, this is Aitan Ajha from InspireToRise.com and I'm not much of a movie guy, I don't watch movies regularly but one of the latest flicks that I saw, Baby Driver 2017, uh, it had one peculiar aspect of technology. The main protagonist in the film uses an iPod Classic all the time, he has like tons of iPod Classics around, lying around, he just uses them and always has music on the go. So uh, it drew me to a question whether the iPod Classic is still worth it in 2017 or not. And today we are going to answer the same question. So guys, for this video, I had to scourge the internet. I had to check almost every place that I could find to buy an iPod Classic. And uh, the only sites where iPod Classic was available was the Chroma website and the location on which it was available was Bangalore. So I could not buy that one. And the other place where the iPod Classic was still listed was eBay. So on eBay, one fine individual was selling one 30 gigabyte iPod Classic for just around 5,000 rupees. I thought that back in the day it was around uh, 11 to 17,000 depending upon the storage capacity and it might not be that much of a bad deal so I bought one for myself in order to test it out in order to find out whether is it a world of difference and uh, can't I listen to Spotify or some other platform on my own mobile phone instead of listening to something like the iPod Classic so before buying this I did my research and found out that the iPod Classic 5th generation had the best DAC around and I bought the same 30GB model white almost looks pristine has a uh, everything good on it just synced it to iTunes and dropped down almost all of my music collection on it which is uh, a much larger than 30 GB and I skipped some of the tracks the initial setup was quite easy you just have to format it reset it using iTunes and then just copy all of the tracks if you want more storage on your iPod Classic you can easily convert all of the high resolution high audio bitrate tracks to 128 kbps AAC and I did not do so for the sake of quality and now let's talk about the experience the first thing is the iPod factor when you have something like this you would definitely put time and attention towards developing a playlist so in order to use the iPod Classic to its fullest I made around 10 playlists one is angry one is motivation one is edgy one is hope slash love and I have a lot of uh, such playlists right now on this device and I uh, change the playlists according to the mood according to the time of the day and shuffle was on almost all of the time and I found that the experience of listening to music while listening on a device which is particularly dedicated to only listening to music and not checking your mail or notifications is quite liberating just go to a faraway place or any other place have something like an iPod with you uh, reconnect from the society reconnect from everything and enjoy the music that's what the experience is for and I guess uh, if you try to do all of these things on your mobile phone you will always be at the end of the day you would not be focusing on the music you would be checking out your Facebook notifications WhatsApp and the whole experience the joy of listening to music would be lost so I guess for anybody who is a music freak or who loves listening to music it's still worth it in 2017 it does not have an internal speaker you can only use good quality earphones headphones or maybe something like an auxiliary cable but still the experience is quite good and if you are somebody like me who is going to upgrade such a device in the near future you can upgrade it up to 2 terabytes of storage using micro sd cards and replace the internal battery upgrade it bump it up to have almost weeks of battery life and all of those mods are still possible with something like this which is so old even the ipod that i have right now it's a 2005 model so these are the sort of tech pieces which are not available right now the manufacturing has stopped and in case you still own something like an iPod Classic, I guess you are one of those real breed of audiophiles and enjoy the music. 